Welcome to YouTube and today we are going to continue with our tutorial series and today we are going to look at how the complete file gets downloaded onto our the torrent software. Right. So over here I'm looking at the woos and I can see you know the file size is 1.65 GB and the download is 358 and we also know now like you know whenever the request comes the tracker puts you into the network then the tracker you know helps you to establish connection with the clients and then you start downloading but and in the end you finish but what's going on behind the scene behind the scene what actually happens is this 1.65 GB file gets broken down into the pieces so it looks something like this <coughs> so now you can see uh, the whole 1.65 GB file into the pieces and their job is to you know fill those pieces I mean fill all the pieces one by one right so when they require a piece okay so what they do is they uh, I mean as usually uh, you have you have seen they sit here and they request the piece and based on the piece availability you know uh, it tries to fetch the data so over here you can see few of the pieces are red which are in the upward direction I should find the pieces of red in the down direction as well well the down direction means it is receiving the data <coughs> it is receiving the data from a peer but the thing is it is not written to my hard drive yet okay and the blue means the data I have completely received and it is written onto my hard drive next is I will show you uh, the upper arrow which we were looking at it means that you know we are giving the data to them completely the opposite party right <coughs> so that's how uh, it works okay so once all the pieces gets filled okay so in the end a pattern emerges and it will you know combine the whole thing into your content let's say if that's a movie so all the pieces combine together and in the end it becomes your file a movie file and then you can play and you can enjoy it right <coughs> so next thing to look at is <coughs> I'm just showing you uh, you know uh, the different tabs and you know it's kind of a miscellaneous but you got the point right how the pieces are get together and how it works over here it shows uh, general information about like how much is being downloaded how much is pending and what is the availability how much is uh, I mean availability I'm sorry I'm pretty bad at that word <coughs> anyways and then also it also calculates your download speed upload speed it estimates your time that how much you have uh, time spent on this and how much is remaining and all right the next thing is a tracker thing I have no idea what it does but I understand these are the different tracker server where it goes and it connects and it tries to find the peers and seeders and leeches and based on that you know it shuffles you into the system or bringing the people more and add into the network so the download gets completed fast <coughs> peers is something which you have seen over here so same I'm looking over here and I can see like you know my connection is established with them and I can see my speed when I'm connecting to them right and if I'm downloading any piece then how what is the position current uh, you know size of a piece and how much is downloaded and what's going on it's like that piece map you have seen file is pretty simple file means like what files we are downloading and how much has been downloaded right next thing is you can look at the speed estimation this is not that important right at the very same times you have tags if there are tags there are tags chat you can have a public chat anonymous chat the way you want I mean this is not generally we do care about right so <clears throat> I hope you got the idea how this system works thanks to tracker and uh, if this video helps you in some way then guys please share this video with your friends subscribe to my channel thank you for watching this video good night and take care